Hello, beautiful babes. Welcome back in. Listen, I was getting ready to go ahead and do another cellulite scrub, and it may be the same one that I've done in the past, but I just wanted to for all of my new viewers to have you to check out how to make a great cellulite scrub at home. And listen, my cellulite is doing better. Yes, it is. Thanks for asking. It is definitely showing much improvement and I am excited about that. And if you're struggling with cellulite, especially as we get a little older, a little bit more sedentary, you know it's going to come, okay? Whether you're working out or it's a lot of people that are so very active. I see them at the gym all the time. They work out constantly, but you know there's still visible cellulite there. So I just do a little scrub to help the process along. And this video today is going to show you how I do that straight to the point let's get to it let me go ahead and pop on my Fermu glasses that's right Fermu if you want to get your pair of Fermu glasses the link is down below beautiful babes it is my affiliate link you already know so check it out if you're looking for some cool stylish affordable glasses okay beautiful babes what I'm gonna do today is that I've gone to Google to try to find another remedy okay and here we go how to get rid of cellulite with a homemade coffee scrub exfoliate those dimples away I'll have this link down below for you to check it out so we're gonna go like verbatim on this particular scrub yes we are it says here this is a DIY to get rid of those it says here that this is one of the scrubs that perhaps the celebrities do. So that sounds promising, right? <laughs> Anywho, let's do this, y'all. Let's do this. Cellulite enemy number one is caffeine, okay? So we do have caffeine. Now check this out. I know my container says decaf on it y'all, but this was just an empty container that I had that I knew could keep my coffee fresh. So when my hubby buys coffee, I take half for my cellulite treatments and he takes half for his drinking. Okay, this is my coffee. So I have the coffee on hand. So then it says we're going to combine it with the moisturizing skin soothing coconut oil and y'all know your girl keep her coconut on hand her coconut oil is right here reporting for duty yes yes and next let's move on let's move on and see what else we can dig into all right it says here that we also need some sea salt oh my god this damn bag of sea salt. I have yet to knock a dent in it. But this is some dead sea salt that I got from Amazon. I'm going to put that damn thing down because that is five pounds of sea salt. Dead sea salt. So it's dead weight and it's heavy as heck. Okay? Yes. We got the dead sea salt. If you don't have dead sea salt, you can also use just white granulated sugar or brown sugar. Today, I'm using the sea salt. So, girls we got this and finally hey dry brush we've talked about dry brushing I actually have another one here I keep one in the bathroom I keep one here in the beauty room and this is a new one that I'm just going to open up and show you the one that I have and it's from Amazon and it's so so cool because uh, yeah it's just cool it's just so so cool to use this is another thing that's really, really helping with the cellulite. So we're going to go walk through using it today. And I have me a little container and I have my measuring tools right here. So I'm going to bring you down so you can see what's going on. Okay. Okay. You ready? Let's get to it. All right. Let me just move some of this stuff out of the way so we can get to measuring our good, good ingredients here. So, I have my bowl right here. Perfect. It says one cup of coffee grounds. So let's take the coffee grounds here. 
and I have a big cup for it right here. So we're gonna scoop out one cup of the coffee grounds. Make sure you got a nice big bowl, and I can already tell this is gonna smell hella good, y'all. Oh yes it is. So there's the one cup of the coffee grounds. Very simple to make. And then we're gonna take, we have our coconut oil. We need six tablespoons of the coconut oil. So let me get to my tablespoon. She's right here. And there is no rhyme or reason to mixing up these things, y'all. There's no verified way. It's just however you want to do it. So, coconut oil is in position to combat the cellulite. Okay, next up, three tablespoons of our dead sea salt. All right, the dead sea salt is right here. Three tablespoons. And we have our dry brush. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and Proceed on blending this all together. And you can actually melt your coconut oil to make this process a little bit easier. I didn't think about that. Okay, now that we're all mixed up here, we are ready to go ahead and just put the lid on it. And before we get into the shower, we need to dry brush. So that's what we'll do next. So let's just get all of this scooped in here because it is ready to apply. And that's perfect right there. Check her out. All mixed in, yes. We'll just put the lid on it for now. And let's just talk about dry brushing. Yes, we've talked about it a little bit in detail on the channel, but today let's talk about it a little bit more. So before getting into the shower, it says here, use your dry brush to exfoliate and stimulate the blood flow. Brush lightly in circular motions. So we're going to take the brush and we're gonna brush in circular motions on any problem areas which this is also great for all over your body to reap the full benefits of dry brushing. So that's how we do that. So for my thighs, I'm going to take my brush and I'll be going into all of those problem areas, brushing towards the heart. And it also has a little handle on it, you can use it like so. I'm going to finish up on my dry brushing. I'm actually gonna brush all over my arms, my legs, my buttocks, the entire body. Yes, I am, because I want all of the great benefits and I'm actually going to do the scrub because not only will it help with the cellulite, it's also gonna make your skin feel so good all over. In the shower, I'm going to apply the cellulite scrub, mainly all over the cellulite areas and then as well as my entire body for whatever is left. So you just simply massage it onto the affected areas in a circular motion and that's how you do that. Now certainly this can be done every single day. Yes, every time you get ready to take a shower, you can repeat these steps and honey, Okay, we ready to get real cute. So I am ready to do that and I hope you are too. I'll have this website down below in the description box for you. I'm getting ready to go ahead and do my entire process right now. Wish you could join me. 
<laughs> just kidding beautiful babes i hope you got something out of this please like comment and subscribe and you know you got to tell mama them you know you got to tell your sister you got to tell everybody everybody do not keep me a secret please don't and you i'm talking about you have not subscribed so you need to go ahead and hit that button and subscribe and the notification bell and that way you'll see me the next time i'll see you beautiful babes Bye.